right guys, we are at a park to play today because we're just trying to survive. Man, I kind of mentioned that at the end of yesterday's video, but like, seriously guys, it's, it's crazy. Like, kids are a legit full-time job because I haven't really been able to do my job, like actual job where we make money and stuff, when it's just me and them. Like, it's been crazy. And I know that makes sense, but I don't know, I just never, I don't know, it's weird like when you have things that you're like, oh, I should really do this, I need to get this done for work, and then you can't. You literally can't. It's like, oh, these kids. But anyways, I love them. Yeah. They're so fun. You doing okay, buggies? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. There you go. Have fun. He's off. Guys, so, all right. You know how, like, you do that? If you're a vlogger, you've totally done this before. So, I started vlogging, right? And I was like, yeah, we're going to this park. I was thinking, yeah, I'll probably film some stuff at the park. Nah. Like, Maddox was about to die like 8,000 times at that park because the boy forgot how to walk and it was just, it had this like weird steep cement hill that he kept running up and was about to just destroy his face on. Anyways, he busted his face. He was like bleeding at one point. Not on that, just from walking on the ground. Anyways, didn't vlog a single thing there. I was kind of frustrated and I was just like trying to make sure that the kids are alive. That's my job, you know? And uh, so then we like get back in the car some of them back there were just asking way too many questions and I was just like, hey, no more talking. And then it was like, zap, 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 literally no talking. And then we drove, we're about to randomly eat at this place, which I, I've only eaten here like twice in my life and it's nothing compared to Chipotle, but I was like, you know what, I'm gonna try something different. But I don't know, we're gonna, I'm already kind of regretting this decision. But anyways, we're gonna try it just cuz but the whole ride over here look at them even just now they've been so quiet I literally told them all right guys no more talking and they didn't talk the entire time and then as soon as we pulled in Kylie <laughs> as soon as we pulled in Kylie goes yay we can talk now hey, what is that bud is that one of your fingernails yeah. did you bite your fingernail off yeah. that's what daddy does you know daddy does that sometimes look, I bite my fingernail off before wow. we even got to the park okay minion Not Okay, bud. And then bite it off. Hey, so, I'm really proud of you guys. Thanks for listening. I appreciate it when you listen. Sorry, I asked too many questions. It's okay. Sometimes you just need to take a break. Your mind, here's the thing, Aj. Your mind is so smart. And you know so many things. And you're so curious about life and about learning things. That sometimes you just have to keep talking. And then daddy's like, yo, it's okay. Wait, well, bud? Were the fellas, you and me? Hey, pound it. Yeah, I'll I'll come back there and we'll pound it. What Udge? Yeah, the, yeah, um what's that? What's that? What's that? What's Anyways. That? What's that? As I was saying, and I was just texting mommy about this. We miss you, mommy. Come home. We miss you! Ah! No, I was literally just texting Brittany. I was like, man, you are the real MVP. Like because this is her full-time job, right? And her full-time job is a thousand times harder than my full-time job of like, I mean, we all do the YouTube thing, obviously. And she's always doing, she's so sweet. Like, obviously, you know, we do branded stuff. We'll do like these Instagram posts, videos, whatever. And there's all this work that goes in behind the scenes to do it. And trying to balance that with real life with kids is really hard. And honestly, and I know, can Some I of you guys are like, stop complaining. Out. But honestly, it's kind of annoying sometimes. Sometimes you're like, oh, I just, I'm just trying to live. But then we also are doing this and we want to do this cool thing. But we have to put work in, I don't know, life. I don't know, guys. Life just got me in my feelings today. So, all right. I've talked way too long. Hey, look, peeps. This is a close up of me. <laughs> all right, Dodge. Should we vlog about this place? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. What do you think about this place, Ud? I think it's a hundred thumbs down. A hundred thumbs down? Why? Why? <laughs> Guys, okay. I'm about to be, this is about to, I'm gonna just warn you. This is gonna be super petty. Okay, and I'm about to say some things that are gonna offend some of you guys, you which is, this should not even be offensive. This is all like, what this is a joke. Is that and this isn't something that serious, but I gotta be real petty right quick. What, Aj? He means that 
um, it's a very corny restaurant. Did you just say corny? Yes. Yo. Like, ah. I never once said that, ever. Like, I, I was, that's actually a better version of what I'm about to say. Guys, okay. <clears throat> what made you think, what made you say that this place is corny? Um, it brings back to a little bit You think this place is corny? Yeah. Alright guys, first of all, let me preface this. You guys, if you know us, if you know me, you know I am like, me and Chipotle are big. Like, we're just inseparable. And honestly, the only reason that we even came here was because, I mean, we've already had like Chipotle at least two or three times in the past week. And this place is kind of like close to our house. And so I was just like, oh, I, and last time I came to Freebirds, gosh, it's probably like two, it was at least three or four years ago. And I was like, Oh, like it just was not good. But the people we were eating with, they were like all about it. They're like, oh yeah, Freebird is so good. And I was like, okay, cool. But I wasn't saying anything, so I'm like, eh. But nah, guys, this place is trash. Uh, first of all, it's just not good. Like, here's like, listen, this phrase, I think. Also, can we listen to this music? Why are we playing classic rock right now? You know what I'm saying, Anj? When you said corny, I thought of this music first. I'm gonna just say this, guys. Normally this phrase is actually pretty, like, ridiculous to say. But in this case, it is, it's valid. You know what, all flavors matter, okay, guys? So, like, you can't just, like, have no flavors. All the flavors matter. So put some flavor into this food, man, jeez. It's just not good. You eat it, it's like, what I just eat? It's like, yo, did I just have a piece of cardboard with the side of, like, lettuce? What's up, bud? Um, I think Chipotle is 200, 200 times better than this trashy, corny place. <laughs> oh my glory. <laughs> Guys, once again, this is petty, this is not serious, it's food. We all, the fact that we can pay to eat places is ridiculous and a blessing. Anyways, back to my pettiness. I mean, this is not good, the flavor is just not good. Like, Chipotle is like, Chip and the other thing too is like, this place, I feel like they try to get you with like, ooh, we got four different types of tortillas. You wanna try this like cayenne uh, tortilla? And I'm like, sure. It doesn't taste good. What do you want to tell the peeps? Uh, ooh, they're like, oh, you could put actual cilantro on your burrito. Yeah, well, the rice that Chipotle has actual cilantro in it, and it's not some weird, like, messed up fake, I don't know. Anyways, one of the main things, though, guys, that really struck me about this place, and I've always thought this subconsciously, but then walking in and looking at, one, both everyone that's ordering and eating here, and two, literally everyone that's working here, too, I was just like, man, the caucasity is real. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's whack. And we're not even in the suburbs. Hey, Pete. What's up, Bodge? You know what? What? This is nothing like Chipotle. Yeah, it's nothing like Chipotle. You just like, you just like being petty. My daddy's being such a terrible example, but, hey, bro, 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 stop. You are, you, talking about being petty, goodness. Oh my goodness, you nasty. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. no guys, but like, oh look, more clientele walking in. I'm just like, and look, I can say this because I'm white, but you know, it's like, goodness. Like, no wonder this place is so basic. That was the most petty thing I've probably ever done, but it had to be said. It was just killing me. And like, I'm just looking around, like everything I see, I'm just like, you know that, you know, you know this gif, you know that gif, like that. That was my face, like every other second I was in this place. That was uh, being petty with Austin and Audrey. Uh, so look forward to no more. Uh, instances of that ever again. <laughs> Banana! What's up, peeps? Mama's coming all home and, uh, in three hours. <laughs> bye bye. What's up? So we are. We are just chilling in here. We've been in the house. You know, relaxing. We've been out a little bit. Not too much. We just went to the splash pad again. Yeah. We've been having some good times. But a little bit bad times. So you saw our video this um earlier um about that place. 
You know the quesadillas there? Yeah. And the rice there? Yeah. The chips there? Yeah. The burritos there? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Everything there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We went to the park and stuff. It was great. Bye, guys. <laughs>